One of the highest ranking members in state government says he has COVID-19. Assembly Speaker Carl Hastie says he only has mild symptoms and does expect to make a full recovery. He says he does plan to keep working from home. Now, the speaker also says he received his first dose of the COVID-19 vaccine more than two weeks ago. None of the available vaccines are 100% effective against infection. But as Jeff Rusak reports, doctors say you are still far better off getting one than not. More and more people are getting a COVID-19 vaccine and more and more people are becoming eligible to receive one. But the vaccine's effect on the virus isn't instantaneous. But after they're vaccinated, they have almost no protection for the first two weeks. So it's critical to be rigorous about public health measures. Obviously, if you've just been vaccinated, you don't want to get infected. You've come this close is not the, po the time to let your guard down. So even with a shot in your arm, you could still contract COVID-19 and test positive for it. But according to health experts, the vaccine considerably reduces the severity and lethality of the virus. But if you do get infected, you're almost certainly going to have either asymptomatic or mild disease and the likelihood of being hospitalized or having a bad, com bad outcome is very close to zero. The window your body needs to fully utilize a vaccine depends on which vaccine you get. Okay, After two weeks, you start building protection, but it's not optimal until at least four weeks after the J&J vaccine, five weeks after the Pfizer vaccine, and six weeks after your first shot of the Moderna vaccine. According to the CDC, no one will test positive for COVID simply for receiving a vaccine. Jeffrey Sachs, 7 Eyewitness News.